I did a little uh, extravagant roast here. I did it oriental style with wasabi and mirin and soy sauce and garlic, shallots, ginger. So I don't know how they'll react to it. Right now it's over the rotisserie. We got hardwood smoke in it. We injected it yesterday and just basically uh, put a rub on it as well and just left it overnight in the cooler. And then whipped it out this morning and as it was cooking we just kept basting it with the leftover sauce and it just soaks it up real good. It's getting smoked and it's injected so it's like super flavored. Why do you think you're going to win, Bill? Uh, the, uh, the special blend of seasonings and the time and care and effort I've put into this roast. Do you want to share your seasonings with us? Uh, I'm sorry, that's top secret. Tell me, why do you think you might win this year? Because I used a really good rub. You're going to take first this year? Well, yeah, because last year I had my orange Jay Cutler jersey, so I think that's what stopped us. marinated my grandma's recipe and Russ who made a Marcel sauce and my sister Pam uh, introduced us to a northern mushroom called chicken in the woods. It's been injected with a couple of pounds of butter a little garlic. We've uh, we've been planning all year. We fortunately were able to land David again. He was in the free agency market. This is our sixth year. Congratulations, that's a long time. Have you ever placed? Never. Let's see the beef footy. Voila! That's beautiful. secrets here I can't really divulge it. I'm thinking you're gonna be seeing me in the winter circle honey. And a lot of love and care for my beef. A very unique sauce it's a chimichurri sauce. Part of it might be the the marinade that we have injected into the beef. If they had a prize for the person that has the most fun I guarantee you I would get it. Thank you to all of you for making this probably the biggest beef ever.